Hey Bulldogs, Chris Bryant, CCIE12933 here and in today's three minute tutorial we're going to answer that musical question to frame or not to frame map. Don't worry there will be no actual singing during this video. I do want to mention though that I have another three minute tutorial out on the comparison of the frame relay map command to the frame relay interface Delsi command. I definitely recommend you look that up on our blog or on the YouTube channel and take three minutes to watch that video. Here I've already got Frame Relay configured in a hub and spoke network. The hub and spoke really doesn't come into play but I want us to really examine the syntax of that frame map command because to some of you you may look at those two statements that you're seeing there and think okay there's something kind of missing there. This command does have a lot of options not all that we need to know for the CCNA but I definitely want to show you the syntax as we go along uh, definitely to help you with exam questions as well. So we've got the frame map command and the first thing we put after that is IP or whatever protocol that we are mapping and here we're definitely mapping IP. Now we're told protocol specific address. It doesn't say is this the local address, is this the remote address and of course the exam is not going to tell you that it probably question you about it. You must remember on a frame map command that you're always mapping the remote IP address to the local DELSI. And here, one of the two addresses we mapped to was that one. So going forward with the syntax, then it just says DELSI. And again, it's not saying remote DELSI, local DELSI. It's always going to be the local DELSI. So here, that was 122. And looking at iOS help now, we've got a lot more options, but we also have this CR at the bottom of the list. Anytime you see that, that means that what you have input to this point is a legal command. And if you hit enter, you know, it's going to go in. So let's go ahead and look at show frame map and make sure the map statements I put in earlier are up and running. And you do see active here and you see static, of course. So assuming all is well on the other two routers, am I going to be able to ping those routers? What do you think with those frame map commands? What do you think? it might surprise you to find out that we can. And what I was alluding to that was missing, and let me go ahead and bring that back up. might put us a little over three minutes, but it's worth it. The option we were looking at was that broadcast option. Without the broadcast option on the end of your frame map commands, your routing protocols will not operate correctly because they're going to be using multicast or broadcast in one way or another both versions of RIP, OSPF, and EIGRP, but you'll still be able to send pings around because pings are unicast. They don't need that broadcast command. So if you're in a home lab, production network, exam question, I don't care what it is, if you can send pings around but your routing protocols aren't working, you probably left that broadcast option off. So be very familiar with the frame relay map command syntax and also know that your pings are going to go through if you leave this broadcast statement off, but multi, uh, multicast and broadcast for our routing protocols will not operate correctly. Again, be sure to look up that other three-minute tutorial on frame relay and the interface Delsi command, and I hope you enjoyed this one. I'm Chris Bryant, CCIE12933.